Hey Brats, welcome back to the channel and today I want to say a huge thank you. I know there's been a lot of craziness going on out there and companies have kind of had to halt on sending us products to review and things to test out for your gaming and fun. Uh, we're kind of starting to see some trickle back in as things are starting to hopefully chill out out there. I know it's not feeling that way for a lot of us, especially here in America. So take care of yourselves out there Brats, be safe. Let's check out this new microphone we got. So this is a Definitely a very budget microphone we got. This is a condenser microphone from IUKUS. <laughs> I-U-K-U-S. The reason I'm interested in this, this is considered to be a better phone microphone. So it uses a 3.5 auxiliary port. It says, of course, it's for <laughs> MSN, QQ, I don't know what that is, Skype, and singing. So we're going to open this thing up and check it out, see how it does on the phone, see if this is what I need to start using when I do vlogs and videos on my phone when I'm moving around. So let's check it out. It says it's got noise canceling, blah, 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 blah. A lot of technical terms we're not that worried about. We're gonna test it. Unboxing should be pretty easy. Boom. Comes with a little stand, which actually is I mean, it's on par with most budget microphones. It looks like it's made mostly out of plastic and metal. The joints are all plastic, which always worries me because that, I mean, you cross thread that plastic on plastic one time and it's gonna damage it. But I mean, for just a free little stand that comes with it, that's fine. This is a condenser microphone, very lightweight. Oh, and interesting. So it comes with an audio splitter so that you can plug this into your phone and then you can have one part for your microphone right here and the other part for headphones. So if you were like doing Skype or vlogging, you need to be able to hear them, you didn't want it to echo back to the microphone, you can actually plug those both in together. So hell, I'll probably grab a set of headphones and check that out. Nice long cord, about six feet long. What, what I'd be wondering though, I mean, it comes with this stand. I wonder if you were to like hold this and use it while you were talking and stuff, I wonder if it would pick up a lot of that movement. So we're gonna test that out too, so. I'm gonna grab a set of headphones. We're gonna switch over to my phone camera and audio, and then we're gonna test this versus just the phone audio itself. So be right back. Now, since I'm just doing a video here, this is not actually a video call. I'm not expecting to actually hear anything through the headphones. I plug these in because I'm interested to see. I really doubt it, but I wondered if they had a relay that actually plays back your audio so you can hear how you sound while recording. That'd be pretty unusual. I'm not even sure that can happen through a 3.5, but I thought it was worth checking out. So let's switch over. It says it's recording audio through the headset. So now what's, I'm curious, there is a mic on this headset, one of those crappy ones. So I'm gonna take that off now. And just as I suspected, it's not playing back my audio to me, which is good because that would sound echoey. Okay, so we are now earbudless, just using this with the splitter still on to see how this sounds. Obviously, I'm not going to be able to tell what's going on or how this sounds until we're done. We're going to turn it backwards just to see how the audio picks up from the other direction. See if this is a pass-through mic, see if this is just going one direction. We're going to find that out too. Man, seeing myself in this video, it is reminding me that I've been in quarantine for a while and... Uh, my hair and beard are getting quite long and I can't do much about it because I am not gonna try and cut my hair myself. All right, let's get rid of that splitter. We are back to phone audio now just for comparison's sake. And we've got the mic plugged in. So something that's, oh, something that's interesting to me here, even though I plugged it in, it doesn't say that it switched over to this microphone. So we might actually be still picking up audio through the phone. If that was picking up through the mic just now, that should have been insanely loud and awful. And if it wasn't, then it's probably, if you know, just hear a little tapping, then we're still picking up through phone. So we've got this thing all the way in. So if it's not registering as a mic, then this isn't helping us. So we're gonna test if this is actually working or not. So plugging just the mic back into the splitter, and I think it's working through the mic now, it says recording audio through headset again. So maybe you have to have the splitter in place. You can't just plug the mic directly in, which is kind of interesting to see that that might be the case. So we're gonna put this really close and see, see how this is doing. Again, switching it this way and seeing how it's sounding backwards. So the microphone picks up surprisingly loud audio. Uh, it's definitely not one that I was holding it too close earlier. It's definitely not one that you need to have right next to your mouth. It 
is it feels plastic it looks plastic i mean it does not look like an expensive or premium microphone by any chance but if you needed a 3.5 millimeter only mic that's going to work just fine for either very minor phone vlogging or something then this actually isn't that bad maybe i'll take it outside real quick and do a wind check so it's a very beautiful day here in oregon i thought let's take this thing out on the balcony and see how it sounds Boy, it is bright out here and I have been, oh man, I can't even keep my eyes open. I've been inside too long with way too much, way too little sunlight. So it's a beautiful day here in Salem. <laughs> can't really see anything from here, but the city is down there. So right now we're seeing how much background noise is this picking up? How much wind? It's not much of a breeze. It's a real light breeze anyways. So cars driving by though, we'll see how this sounds. The mic sounds good. I've actually been holding it too close, I can tell. It's a condenser microphone. It picks up good audio. It definitely is sensitive, but it has some noise canceling built in. The problem being when I'm using this with my phone, there's probably some settings I can change, but I can't easily just like flip a volume switch real quick and turn it down a little bit like I would if I was using this on a PC. So it might pick up more audio than I'm wanting it to. The build quality feels fine. I mean, you can feel it's plasticky. It's like a, it's like a soft touch plastic. It's and it, it looks like plastic, it looks cheap, but I mean, this works better than I would have expected it to. So let's just take a look, the little stand that it came with. So really, you would put this in here, and then you would have a standing mic. So I mean, if you wanted to have better mic audio quality for Zoom calls, if you were using this for maybe maybe very minor vlogging or something, uh, or you just need a really cheap starter mic. For the price, this is not bad. And the fact that if you specifically need a 3.5 millimeter mic, like this one, not a USB one, this is gonna do the job for you. So I would say it's fine. Uh, if you wanna check it out, I will leave the link in the description, just in case. If this is on sale at the time, which I know it hasn't been before, if this is 10 bucks, then this is definitely not a bad mic if you wanna upgrade your phone one a bit and make it sound a lot better. So I'll probably actually continue to use this. I'll probably find a way to mount this to my phone so that when I'm taking shots with my phone, if I need to be mobile, when I'm doing videos, I'll actually probably continue to use this microphone mounted up on my phone to where it'll all be all in one, easy to hold and make my life a little bit easier and a little better audio quality for all of you. So thank you so much for watching today and I will see you in another reality.